guys, I know this is like a weird angle. I forgot my uh, tripod for the car, so this will do for now. But I today is Friday. It's the 13th. But um, today I'm actually going to a concert for um, Justin Gabriel's Another Day and Another Tour. Okay, New, New Jersey, come on. <laughs> guys, you guys gotta be there you go. Man, that's what I was waiting for. Gosh. Come in. <laughs> Jason Gabriel. Okay, all right, before before we come out, Justin Gabriel have asked me personally um, to <laughs> see what I did there. Anyway. Um, you guys know what's good. I like you, New Jersey. All right. We need a countdown going, so I think we should start at around 10. Does that sound good? Yeah. 10, 9, 8, eight 7, 6, I think my ears are bleeding. Oh. We love you too. Man, you guys look good, New Jersey. You guys are a good looking crowd. Okay, okay. Wait, love you too. Before we begin, I'm a little sick today. Um, oh. Everyone say, we love you, Jess. We love you, Jess. Is it okay if you guys sing along with me when I sing? Yeah. Thanks. <laughs> Thank you, guys. All right, Lottie. Yeah. They know the vlog references. Yeah. Let's get the show on the road, shall we? Yeah. But first... There's nothing in it, it was just for the joke. <laughs> oh man. All right, but you guys want to get into the first song? Yeah! You were my September song, summer lasted too long. The time moves so slowly, when we're only 15. You were my September song, tell me where I am. Thank you. 
Chasing the strangers of places Down in the underground station Passing by I get a mad to the danger I feel like my heart couldn't take it And cause if we met with you strangers You and I You better watch out You better not cry You better not pout I'm telling you why Just a good old classic juju on that beat for you. Okay. Man. So this next one has to be really sad. Yeah, this has to be shows. The first few shows, we brought him out and everyone screamed and he got terrified. Hi, buddy. Hello. Everybody say, hi, Milo. Hi, Milo. Milo, what do you have to say? <laughs> Just licked the mic. Guys, he just got a haircut <laughs> the other day. Can we just talk about it? He, the groomer gave him eyelashes. Um, I don't think you can see him up close, but. It. And it's so cute. Oh, anyway. He's kind of scared right now. You're smart. You didn't repeat it that loud. Okay. So I like you guys. Say, say bye. bye, my love. Bye. <laughs> Isn't he cute? Do you want to explain this next part? Yeah, so this one's a little a little weird to explain. This so, is kind of when the show like goes a little like different yeah, and than our usual shows. And it's always one of like our favorite <laughs> moments in the show. So we um, really wanted to keep it. However, today. Jess is having a difficult time singing this song. Um, so this song, this next song, will be to like the original track. So Jess's voice is in the background, and we're all, we all yeah, feel comfortable singing okay. together. We just really didn't want to like leave. This much I know is true. That God bless the broken road that led me straight to you. two packages there is regular vip and then super vip and super vip was before the show and the the regular vip was after the show which i think is smart i don't know if they allow this or not i assume they do but if someone is running late for the super vip if like they hit traffic or something um then they can still have a chance to meet them after the show you know so I think that's a smart idea even just for a super i mean regular vip if you're running late you're not going to miss the meet and greet so i think that was smart but anyways moving on so when i got there um james james i'm thinking btr um gabe was first and then it was just so i hugged gabe said hello 
And he wasn't talking or anything because he was on vocal rest because he, he just physically couldn't talk anymore. Um, my friend had told me about that when um, she went and she had general admission, which I thought was very sweet of them to do because Jess was sick at the show. Um, and they had, well, she wasn't like very sick, but she was still sick. Um, you guys know they had to actually postpone the Washington show and do and you want to say hi? Say hi. Oh my god, you're so heavy. <laughs> Ow. <laughs> Sing hi. <laughs> you guys know they had to postpone the Washington show because uh, Jess was sick and she can, couldn't perform and stuff. She wasn't feeling well enough to perform and they always want to put on their best show, etc, etc. Bruh. <laughs> and, um, so yeah, so because of that, they actually, they had to do the show a little bit different than the regular shows that they have done before. Um, and because of that they said actually that general admission people could meet them but it was like 10 to 15 people at a time go take a picture with them and stuff like that so yeah and then it was vip anyways so i got there gabe wasn't really um talking it was on vocal rest and yeah so <laughs> then i come gabe said hello went to Jess said hello and now I have the picture which I'll insert and <laughs> you can see that my like this hand was not a, like I wasn't hugging Jess with both of my hands because I was holding a gift bag for them uh for the gifts that I got for them and it was heavy because there was like mugs and stuff in there um and I didn't want to like go like that and hug her and then have that hit her in the back so that's why I didn't I was just like holding my hand down and it's just kind of awkward <laughs> but I didn't want to hurt her you know because like it was heavy and like I knew that would feel uncomfortable so anyways so yeah so then after I was done hugging Jess I went to position myself in between them and I accidentally stepped on Gabe's foot because I didn't know I was that close to him and then I was like, sorry. <laughs> like, there is always, every time I go to some kind of meet and greet, there's always something that happens. Like, okay, so yeah. So then I took the picture with him and, and, yeah. And then I said, and Jess was like, it was so nice meeting you. And I was like, you too. And then I hugged them again. Uh, both of them again. And then I, I left. And that was, that was it. I wanted them to sign my, my badge. And I wanted to take a video with them for the vlog and stuff. Yeah, all that just went whoo, out of my head. I got, I, I was starstruck. And I was, everything that I was like planning while I was on the line went it, it just it, it took a vacation from my my mind and then it came back when I was done and then when I was walking I know I was smiling and everything and then I looked down and it's like damn it I forgot I was gonna get them to sign my VIP badge I even I didn't know if they were gonna have a sharpie or not I even had a sharpie in my in my pocket which you can also kind of see in the picture I'll have it zoomed in and show it over here but yeah but then I don't know if it was the day, I think it was the day after, um, I tweeted it, I tweeted the picture the day of and stuff, and I, I posted it to Twitter and Instagram with different captions though, and I freaked out because just liked my, my picture on my Instagram account, I, I wasn't expecting that, I was like, oh my god, so I had like a little fangirl and everything, and then it didn't stop there. Then Gabe had tweeted my meet and greet picture and everything, and I was like, what? the heck I was like freaking out guys that is it that's it so if you guys like this video be sure to give it a thumbs up don't forget to subscribe down below and 